People need to move from coastal towns and cities for several interconnected reasons, primarily driven by the impacts of climate change, global warming, and specifically sea level rise. Here are some key reasons for this need to relocate. Sea level rise. Rising global temperatures are causing the polar ice caps and glaciers to melt, leading to an increase in sea levels. This results in more frequent and severe coastal flooding and erosion, putting coastal communities at risk. Increased flooding. Coastal areas are experiencing a higher frequency of flooding, including sunny day or nuisance flooding, which can disrupt daily life, cause property damage, and strain resources. Storm surge risks. As sea levels rise, storm surges during extreme weather events become more destructive, posing a significant threat to homes and infrastructure in coastal areas. Erosion and land loss. Coastal erosion exacerbated by rising seas is causing the loss of land, beaches, and ecosystems, impacting property values and the natural environment. Saltwater intrusion. Sea level rise can lead to saltwater intrusion into freshwater sources, compromising drinking water quality and agricultural productivity. Infrastructure vulnerability. Coastal cities often have critical infrastructure, including ports, power plants, and transportation systems located in low-lying areas, making them vulnerable to sea level rise and flooding. Economic impact. Coastal businesses and industries may face disruptions, leading to economic challenges, job losses, and decreased property values. Long-term resilience, moving to higher ground, is a proactive strategy to ensure long-term resilience in the face of climate change and its associated challenges. Community safety. Relocating can enhance the safety and well-being of residents by reducing their exposure to flooding and the risks associated with sea level rise. Sustainable urban planning. It provides an opportunity to plan and develop cities and communities that are more sustainable, resilient, and adaptable to changing environmental conditions. The need for relocation is driven by the imperative to adapt to a changing climate and protect the safety, livelihoods, and well-being of coastal populations. Effective land use planning, urban development, and international cooperation are essential components of addressing this pressing issue. People forced to leave coastal areas due to sea level rise may relocate to various types of destinations. The specific locations will depend on individual circumstances, local planning, government policies, and personal choices. Here are some potential destinations for people relocating from coastal areas. Inland cities and towns. Many people will move to urban or rural areas further inland, seeking safety from sea level rise and coastal flooding. Inland cities and towns can provide a range of housing, job opportunities, and infrastructure. Relocation campuses. Some governments may establish planned relocation campuses or communities in safer regions to accommodate displaced residents. Existing inland communities. People may join existing communities and neighborhoods in safer areas, integrating with the local population. Disaster-resilient housing. Innovative housing solutions, including amphibious homes, floating structures, and flood-resilient buildings, may provide secure housing options in coastal regions. Overseas relocation. In extreme cases, international migration may occur as residents move to countries that are less susceptible to sea level rise and flooding. It is generally advisable for people to plan and move in advance of severe floods and sea level rise. A proactive approach allows for better preparation, smoother transitions, and the avoidance of last-minute emergency evacuations. Early action also helps minimize disruptions to communities and reduces the strain on resources and emergency services. Sea level rise is typically a gradual process and it does not usually result in sudden catastrophic floods on a global scale. Instead, it leads to more frequent and severe coastal flooding, which can disrupt daily life, damage property, and have long-term impacts on communities. However, the rate of sea level rise can vary by region, and some areas may experience more rapid changes than others. This makes early planning and relocation efforts crucial for addressing the long-term challenges posed by sea level rise.